Well, howdy, folks. Then we're back to you. So I'm, I'm fixing to show you how I do my uh, plastic recycle. This may be a little different than yours. If it is, you know, you might like it better. Or you might say, ah, yeah. But I've got one of these. Uh, it's a hamper for clothes. Got a lid on it. And uh, it's breathable so all that stuff can dry. It won't get smelly. And uh, I tried for years and years to uh, figure out a neat way of having a, an inside bin to put my scrap plastic in. And I take this out and put it in the, uh, the dumpster that the... Uh, garbage truck comes around every so often and, and gathers the plastic uh, recycle stuff but uh, this has got a little lid on it that's got a, a pin on each side goes up in a hole you can take that pin out and this one's about broke I'm, I'm going to have to uh, start putting a screw in it I've got it just about broke there on the corner, taking it in and out. I keep this back in another room. I'll empty empty the various ones. I've got uh, one by the chair where I sleep I'll, all my drink bottles and everything goes in it and I dump it in here when this gets full I was taking it out and just putting it directly in the, the uh, recycle bin but the wind came along one day and knocked it over and I had little pieces of plastic everywhere <laughs> so I said well okay So these are leaf bags. And that racket that you hear where it's coming off, that's static electricity. So if you touch somebody and knock the far out of them, they put the far in them. You can touch your uh, uh water faucet and pop yourself with it. And you come over the top of it. Well I got those top two corners on there. Make sure you got it down all the way because if it's not, it'll make a mess. get on one corner on one side and work my way down to the, the mess you turn that over set that on if you got a platform where you're not bending your back all the way down come down and you feel the, the load under you and you gather this all the way across on that as you hope you're holding this let the air come on out and I got a little pair of these and 
and you're pushing the air out work it down as it goes Get it down there where there's not much air in it. I could have done that all day without doing that. Double that over on itself and put your clamp on it. And it lives there when you you can dump that thing about three times in this this will just go down in one of those uh, hoppers or uh, bins that, you know that you see on the side of the road to come along and get and a whole two of them and I've found if you do it this way when it gets up the top, put your tie wrap around the top of it, snag it down good. Or if you've got enough room, don't use those little straps that comes on it. Tie a knot in it. Because if those bust, you still got little pieces of stuff all over the place. This way, if the wind knocks it over, so what? You got two of these laying around. You know, just go get them and put them back in there. So, put that in each side like that. Put it up in the corner somewhere or another. You good to go and put on there uh, no garbage recycle only because some yahoo will stick something other in there that they're not supposed to or come by and spit in it or you know you'll have backer juice all over the place <laughs> so uh, y'all like and subscribe hit the bell make comments and it's general I'm out